Shalom. Sometimes it's a real challenge to study the books of kings. There are so many of them, and they overlap at different funny times, and they have the same names. But I, I tried to make a complete list. Some of the lists will just start with Saul, not even with Saul. They'll just start with David and Solomon. But we know Saul was the first ruler, and his son did reign. His son is usually left off these lists, but Saul's son did reign even though it was contemporaneous with David, so I left him on. I also left Absalom on because he was kind of conniving his way to the top for many years, and David did leave the city, and so Absalom was in charge for that short time. And afterwards, of course, there was Solomon. And then the kingdom was divided. In this chart, the kings of Judah, the southern kingdom, are on the left, and the kings of Israel, or Ephraim, the northern kingdom, are on the right. Now, they're not lined up according to the time periods in which they were serving. They are just in, in order, in chronological order for the time they served. And we know that the northern kingdom went into exile some 130 years before, before the southern kingdom. And so they didn't end at the same time, even though it looks like that on the chart. One other person who's often left off these charts is Tipney. Uh, he was serving at the same time as Omri, I think. They overlapped a bit. But if you count all these people up, there are 45 of them. Here's another chart. This is the presidents of the United States. Some people say that the United States is kind of parallel to the nation of Israel because both nations began with a covenant with the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. We're not really here to talk about that, but we do know that the number of presidents that we have had is the same number, 45. I thought that was kind of interesting. Grove or Cleveland did serve two terms, but they were not contiguous, so he has two numbers, 22 and 24. And I did leave Jefferson Davis off this chart. I just thought it was interesting they were both 45. Of course, we are waiting for the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords, the one true leader who will bring peace to this earth. Yeshua HaMashiach, Jesus the Messiah, may it be soon. Shalom.